Hi there, Tamara Carroll, the Joy Queen and your creativity coach. I just wanted to pop in real quick before I um, actually sell some of these beautiful paintings and just show you my prophetic wall and uh, tell you a little bit about what the Lord has had on my heart lately. Um, so just to give you a little scan here, um, let me see if I could show you the very first one that I did. Uh, there's a little bit of light reflection there, but um, this one, I don't think I can get it just right. Look, you can see the crown on my wall and the reflection, that's fun. Um, but this one was uh, coming into his presence and um, it had so much meaning for me that my husband actually had it framed for me. And so what I do is I pray and I worship and if I'm doing a commissioned piece for somebody, then I pray for that person uh, while I'm painting. And so um, I just wanted to show you, this one was one of the second one, second or third one that I did. I don't have any um, formal artistic training at all. And I don't know if you could see the detail. I finger paint and so I just really depend on the Lord to um, tell me the colors to use and the textures and how to use my hands. And so this one was uh, for a friend that I was praying for and I kept hearing uh, Metamorphosis. And as it turns out, she has a digital magazine called Megamorphosis. So, wow, that was really, really cool um, when I had the opportunity to paint and pray through this particular painting. Um, this next one down here was for another friend that I really wanted to um, share with you. I share this one a lot on my wall. I think that it is just exquisite, um, you know, just in the, in the details that the Lord had given me. And so again, this one comes with a prophetic word um, for this particular person. So um, a lot of layers and seashells and a tremendous amount of meaning in that one. So very cool. Um, let me just go back over here. So this is one that I'm um, selling today. And this one was called His Mercies Are New Every Morning. Um, I don't know if you can see really, but there's a lot of gold, and sparkle, just a lot of um, a lot of meaning in this one. So super excited to give this one um, a new home today. It's really hard for me actually to uh, to part with the paintings um, because I have an encounter with the Lord um, while I am painting them. So. But they were intended for certain people, so I'm going to go ahead and, and sell them. But this one is a peek into a heavenly garden. And again, all of my paintings are done um, with my fingers and really with the Holy Spirit um, leading. So I love this one a lot. Um, this one is for another girlfriend who uh, she told me that she had a vision of worshiping God and she was wearing a yellow dress and it felt like she was a butterfly. So I love this one a lot. Again, lots of uh, dynamic colors and um, it's a very special painting too. So very cool. Um, this one is called A Mother's Heart and um, this one I painted when um, a friend of mine, her son was missing and it didn't turn out well at all. And if you can see the, the red and the strokes, I wept as I was painting this one. And um, it was just, it was healing for me, but I also could feel, um, I could feel the, the trauma as I, as I painted this for her. So I'm gonna be sending this one to her personally. 
and then let's see if we go over here. This one was one of the first ones that I did. This was also a heavenly garden picture. I believe there's flowers that the Lord showed me that I have never seen in real life. And, um, you know, it's hard to paint colors from heaven because, um, you know, it's, it's just difficult because we don't have the mixture of those colors. But, again, all finger painted and totally led by the Spirit. This one I had originally called um, a sunrise, a heavenly sunrise. And one of my girlfriends said it looks like creation. And so I was like, yes, that's what it is. It is going to be called creation. So this one is for sale, by the way, as is this one here. And uh, this one is a work in progress. Um, this one is a commissioned piece. And uh, lots of details came out on this one. The Lord had me using parts of my hand that I've never used before in painting. And so the colors, I don't know if you could see the horse. Sorry, my hands shake. There's a horse right there with a blue mane. Uh, people have seen Jesus and Moses. And um, so I'm excited. I just love the blending of the colors in this. Looks like a heart or a bird. So anyway, that one is super fun. Let's see if I can scan over here really quick. This one is also a commissioned piece for someone. I thought maybe it needed more, but I really feel like it's done. And um, so this one again is a commissioned piece for a client and it will come with a prophetic word. I love colors. Colors just really make my heart sing. And I love working with acrylics. Um, there's something in the texture that is just so cool. And then this was just one that I had done shortly after the, um, the shooting in Las Vegas. I had a friend who's or an acquaintance, someone I knew whose 21 year old daughter was killed. And um, so this was a healing art piece and it has many layers in it. So if you'd like to know some more information about that, I'd be happy to share. And then this one is my angel. And um, I kind of laugh because she has really big hair and really big wings. Um, and I do believe in angels. Uh, they're all through the Bible. And um, so, um, yeah, I just, I just think that they're all part of... Um, you know, the heavenly contact that we have that the Lord has given us um, in the fullness of God. So anyway, just wanted to share that with you. Thanks so much for popping in and I will talk to you soon. If you are interested in receiving your own prophetic painting uh, with a prophetic word, reach out to me and we can talk. Okay, God bless you. Take care. Tamara Carroll, the Joy Queen and your creativity coach. Bye.